Every four years, I get a fever, Jose, and it can't be cured by any kind of medicine or even cowbell. It's Olympics fever, and it is upon us, my friend. It is. The Olympic Games are here, taking place in London. That's right. We're looking at the London Olympics 2012, the official game from Sega. Now, we've played a lot of these Olympic Games in the past, Winter and they're Olympics. always Summer a Olympics. little bit of a letdown. Jose, is this a letdown? You know, I was a little bit surprised by this game. Usually, these games, they put too much thought into them. I found this game was really accessible for each of the 46 events. I think this is the first time, by the way, anyone's ever said, the problem is they're putting too much thought into a video game. I think that's a first on well, movies on the you road. You know, they overthink it. It's like, well, we're gonna put this in, well, like we're gonna do the discus. So we'll have you spin around the control, hold the right bumper, and then when you point a release, press the A button. It's like, sounds pretty good to me. No, it's way too complicated. Okay. Just let me smash on the A button, flick up one of the analog sticks, boom, discus thrown. World record set. That's what I did in this game. I broke records. This is a fantastic moment that everybody in the stadium can enjoy. Well, they definitely give you a lot. Deadlift. Uh, yeah, I did it. It's good. 215. Like nice. Record broken. They definitely give you a new look at an Olympics game. We played so many over the years where you're just tapping A as fast as you can. You're just tapping A to do everything and then hit the button to jump or whatever. This game, they threw a lot of new mechanics in there. I like the new mechanics they have for running. It's more about your pace and not yeah. going too far. Don't slam on it. You're not the fastest finger in the world. You know, it's all right. Just take it easy. You keep it in the bar, you're going to wear yourself out. I like that. They, I mean, they reuse it a lot, and that's, I guess, my main problem with this game, as it is with all Olympics games, is that you have a lot of events that are sort of the same. I mean, you mentioned 46 events, but but that includes men's and women's versions of those events. So you're talking really about 30 events. And then a lot of those are the same mechanics. I mean, the triple jump and the long jump is basically the same thing. Hey. There's, there's not a lot of different gameplay in If there. you're running and jumping, don't change the damn mechanic on me. I don't think it needs to be so simple. I disagree with you. I think there's always an opportunity here. These games come along once every four years. We've already seen so many different versions of the long jump and versions of the triple jump. I always want to see new things in here. I did like that core new mechanic, though, with the running. And I thought that some of the events, as is usually the case in Olympics games, works better than others. I liked all the track and field stuff, and I also liked there was like a speed shooting. I didn't even know that was an event. Yeah, speed speed shooting. shooting. All the games that were sort of more arcadey, there was volleyball, ping pong. I didn't think those were good at all because to me they felt like dumbed down versions of better games. I mean, we've seen great ping pong games like the one that Rockstar made a couple years ago, and we've seen some good volleyball oh, games. Yeah. yeah, but here's the thing. You win your qualifying, you get into the actual event, you win the gold, look how proud you are, you're up on the podium, and they only play like 10 seconds of your national anthem. This is the Olympics. It's the only time where they should actually put the entire anthem for in there. For every Why not? country, though? We have like 30 countries in here. Well, you're going to be sitting there for like an hour you listening to something. It. Nah, didn't bother me. Uh, I was drum, too busy breaking nuts. world records. Well, Jose, clearly you had a fun time winning and breaking all these world records in this Olympics game. But as is always the case, it's time for the judges to weigh in. Jose, what are you going to give London Olympics 2012? Seven. I'm giving it a six out of ten.